On the evening of September the 16th, 2008, 49-year-old Michael Garland went for a jog at Northwest 152nd Street and 18th Avenue near Rainbow Park Elementary School. He never made it home. Here's the story. Michael Garland, a 49-year-old male, was jogging in the neighborhood in the area of uh, 1840 Northwest 152nd Terrace. Uh, as he was jogging eastbound on the sidewalk area, he was approached by either an individual or several individuals. One of the suspects furnished a handgun, at which point Michael Garland attempted to gain some distance between the assailants and himself in order to defuse the situation. And he crossed to the south side of the street. And in the process, one of the assailants shot him in the back, at which point Mr. Garland's collapsed on the floor and the assailants fled the area. Uniform officers were dispatched to the area. Upon their arrival, they found Mr. Garland laying on the ground. Fire rescue also responded and they transported him to uh, Jackson Memorial Hospital Rider Trauma Center. Upon his arrival at the hospital, he expired. There were several kids or juveniles playing basketball in the basketball court located just north of where the incident had occurred. We're hoping that maybe the parents that live in the neighborhood and who have children who frequent the basketball court area, if they would be willing to take a moment of their time and uh, talk to their children uh, in reference to this incident, then maybe their children have been a little bit reserved to give that information because they haven't been asked. We don't have any reason to believe uh, that Michael Garland had any enemies. Uh, he comes from a loving family. His whole entire family are very respectable individuals. If anybody has any information, uh, we're requesting or asking that you please contact the Miami-Dade Police Department Homicide Bureau at 305-471-2400. Why won't the community just come forward and say, I know something. I'm not afraid to call. I'm not afraid to let someone know what I saw, what I heard. Does it have to come into your home before you want to take any action towards this, it has to stop. And the pain will never end. But if it could save someone else from this, I would never want anyone else to experience this. But sadly, it's happening more and more every day. Miami-Dade detectives have little to go on in this case. Hopefully one of our viewers can give police the information they need to solve it and take a killer off the streets. If you have any information that may help detectives solve this case, call Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS.